video is going to be on a Husqvarna 450 rancher that came in with a diagnosis of the engine runs fine, but the chain won't turn. So if you're interested, stay tuned. We'll get right into it. So we got this, uh, you know I hate chainsaws, I'm, I can't say that enough. So we have a Husqvarna 450 Rancher. It comes in with the uh, diagnosis from the customer that uh, it cranks and runs fine, but the chain will not spin. All right. There's the picture of the clutch. I took it off. This turns fine. There's no play in the bearings that I can tell right away. Uh, when I cranked it up, it turned for a minute. So I took the chain off. You know, this looks fairly clean. I mean, it's dirty, but it's clean. That's not, the brake band wasn't bothering it. But I don't know if y'all can see down in here. I'm gonna turn this. Well, first I'm just gonna shine it down in there. You can see there's a whole hunk of that uh, sprocket missing off the drum. it spinning around slow like that now when you get to right there you can see the needle bearing so it's missing like two or three teeth on that uh, on that sprocket on the drum so I checked the bar uh, it's pretty straight the tip uh, check these out up here you know the tip spins fine right there so that's not it I tried to determine what broke that, broke those teeth off, unless it's just overheated. Uh, I'm not sure. You can see, if you look at this clutch good, right here you can see evidence of overheating. Right in there. And right in there. So, uh, for sure we're going to have to have a clutch kit, you know, new drum and clutch. There's, look at that. Anyway. So when I pull this the rest of the way off, I'll get back with you. So, uh... We're gonna take this clutch off now. So you can see I've inserted a piston stop in here. It's a 14 millimeter or 12 millimeter piston stop. And uh, if you look on the clutch here, we're gonna be, it says off this away. So I'm gonna take me a punch and hit it with a hammer and knock it loose. I just get me a punch like so. Get in here. This clutch is ruined, so I mean we're gonna have to replace it. It's burned up. So just tap gently. It shouldn't take a whole lot. You may have to brace the saw with your hand. Finally, it'll. Uh, I done got grease on me. But finally it'll it'll free up. And you, you can just spin it the rest of the way off. So here we go. We're gonna see what, what's going on. Alright. There's the clutch. Like I said, it's, you can see the blue marks on it where it's hot. Let's pull this drum off. Ooh. That's nasty. There's the other teeth, pieces. Now, there's your needle bearing, and there's no needles left in it, <laughs> obviously. But there is no play in the crank. So I think that's uh, what we're going to have to, that's going to be it. Now I am going to inspect the chain and make sure there's nothing uh, on it. So, all right, guys, if anybody knows what causes this uh, directly, please leave me some comments. Like, like my channel. And hit that subscribe button, boys. Y'all are coming on strong. We're up to 180 when I checked this morning. Coming on strong, over 25,000 views. I appreciate you guys. Keep on keeping on. Jungle Bob out.